Hi everyone, welcome back to Richmond Public Library Presents Story Shorts. My name is Mr. Lewis from the Ginter Park Library, and today I'm going to be reading Steam Train Dream Train by Sherry Dusky Rinker, illustrated by Tom Lichtenheld. It's a fun little story that works both as a nice way to settle down before bedtime and as a fun way to describe some of the different kind of train cars and how they're used. Steam Train Dream Train by Sherry Dusky Rinker, illustrated by Tom Lichtenheld. Through the darkness, clickety-clack, coming closer down the track. Hold your breath so you can hear huffing, chuffing, drawing near. A whistle blares out in the night, a mighty engine, wondrous sight. The smokestack puffs, the big wheels grind, the trusty tenders close behind. Cling, clang, the bell rings out on top, hissing steam, brakes squeal, then stop. The driver signals to the crew. Each worker knows just what to do. Quick, before it gets too late, start to load up all the freight. Everything will soon be stowed, a train car matched to every load. The crew slides back the boxcar doors and tumbles in to start their chores. They whirl, twirl, cartwheel, jump, but cargo's stowed without a bump. Things that rock and roll and spin, all are juggled safely in. The freight is loaded as they play, they work and bounce the night away. Building blocks, erector sets, bikes and kites and model jets, the boxcar is made to safely haul almost anything at all. The hopper's top is open wide, so cargo can be poured inside. The crew hops to it, one and all. They get to work and have a ball. Then with a bounce, a pounce, a leap, three boys jump in and fall asleep. Tankers lined up in a row are getting filled with paints to go. Purple, yellow, green, and blue, a color convoy coming through. The reefer car is snug and cold. Its chilly box can safely hold frozen treats for every stop, like a rolling ice cream shop. The train car's packed. The crew sits back and chills out with a midnight snack. Ten hard workers lend a hand to fill the gondolas with sand. Sand for castles, moats, and more. Sand for tunnels. Sand galore. Stacked up on the auto rack, six race cars for a private track. Rainbow colors, flames, and stripes. Shiny engines, chromey pipes. The auto rack will gently keep these fast, fast cars all fast asleep. The well cars carry giant beasts, munching on enormous feasts. Brachiosaurus likes the view, while T-Rex gets a bone to chew. The flatbed cars are rolling beds. The weary crew can rest their heads and settle in and tuck in tight. Their work is finished for tonight. The red caboose is last in line. From the lookout, all looks fine. The freight and crew are tucked away. The next stop is another day. A hiss, a jolt, a shift and sway, and now the journey's underway. The train's departing car by car. The headlight fades into the stars, puffing, chuffing out of sight. Steam train, dream train, shh. Good night. So I hope you all enjoy the story. There sure are a lot of different kinds of train cars, aren't there? Did you know that they had special cars to carry really cold things like ice cream? It's amazing how many different things we can move across the country with trains. I love this story. It's a lot of fun to read, especially before bed. 
and the pictures are so silly and cute. Parents, if you would like to check out this book for yourself, you can find it and many more children's stories on Overdrive and Hoopla. Just go to www.rvalibrary.org, click on Kids at the top of the page, and scroll down to ebooks and e-audio to access our complete digital media collection. All right, well, that's all for today. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can be updated regularly on our programming. We have two short stories and a crafting video every week, so be sure to check back again. Thank you all so much. Stay safe and keep reading. Thank you.